Well, today the Atlanta School Board met for the first time since announcing that they will not renew the current superintendent's contract when it ends next June. 11 Alive's Bo Beth Yates was there for the meeting, but Bo Beth, even though parents are definitely talking about this during the meeting, the board was not. That's exactly right. And in fact, that meeting is still going on as we speak. But so far, the board has not brought it up at all. But we do expect to hear from parents when the public portion comments of the meeting begins in just about 30 minutes. There are some nuances to that, which I think Atlanta Public School Board members made no mention during their meeting this afternoon that they won't be renewing Dr. Lisa Heron's contract after it ends June 30th, 2024. After making the announcement Friday afternoon, the board still hasn't specified why. The district hired Dr. Herring in 2020 during the height of the COVID pandemic. A large part of her tenure was focused on addressing pandemic learning loss. 11 Alive reached out to Dr. Herring for an interview, but the district referred us to a statement she released reading in part. In December 2022, I received my last performance evaluation and satisfactory feedback with emphasis on the focus of additional engagement and stronger communication efforts. I have worked diligently to honor the work and expectations of our board and community. She went on to recap some of her accomplishments, like the 84% graduate graduation rate in 2022, the highest in APS history, and corporate partnerships with companies like Google, Apple, Nike, and Amazon, allowing students to earn college credits and gain real-world experience. Now the district is now in hiring mode to replace Dr. Herring, and we expect to hear from parents who oppose and support this move in just about 30 minutes. Of course, we'll continue to follow those public comments and bring you updates as we get it. Sending it back to you in the studio.